guys today i thought that i would why is my camera like kind of dirty is it better now anyways today i thought that i would redesign my wall like my bedside wall just because i've had this design i guess for like the past year and a half plus 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 and i'm kind of sick of it i don't think it's ugly i just feel like i want something different you know so here's what it looks like now over here we have a mickey mouse poster singapore nike apple scotland and then some movies and then we have like this Spotify wall kind of thing and I just feel like it's boring I don't want the Spotify thing anymore yeah basically I just um wanted to find different and new posters that I like more to put on my wall so that's what we're gonna do I already have a few um saved on like a Pinterest board that I have so we're gonna find a few more and then like select the favorites and get them printed out. So here's my current um, Pinterest board of basically posters that I kind of want to print out um, for my wall. Um, for my new wall design, I want it to be a little bit more like minimalistic, a bit more modern. Because um, these are all like the old ones from like last time, what I was considering. And like these are the newer ones up on top. Yep. One of them that I really like is this. I think this is so cool. Um, anyways, yeah, we're gonna continue searching for more similar ones to these and I'll be back in a second. Okay, it is now like three or four days later, but <laughs> I finally have kind of consolidated the different posters that I like. I don't really know how many I'm gonna choose, probably about like 20 um, to print. I'm just gonna put them all into a Google document, so I'll show you that in a second. Okay, so here I've just put them all into a Google Doc. Um, this is like roughly what I want to print. Um, as you can see, I'm going for a more like modern, minimal kind of vibe, um, and yeah, this is what I've come up with so far. I definitely want a few more, but for now, this is my short list. I want to find, I don't know, just like a bit more color, I don't know. Um, and yeah, like I said earlier, I'm probably taking down like everything, not keeping anything, including these because they're getting kind of old, but I'll print these tomorrow morning. And I will get them ready to go on my wall. Hello, it is like the next day again, but I finally printed out some of the posters um, just on plain paper. And I'm thinking of whether I want to cut them with like scissors or with a ruler. I think I might go with a ruler because like I prefer the edges to be a bit messy because I feel like if it's too neat, it's not nice also. And like if I cut with scissors, there's a lot of potential of like the line not being straight and like paper cuts so I don't want to risk that but here are the ones that I printed so far um yeah I don't know whether I'll do more I'll see like how much space these fill up first but yes that's the progress okay so I cut out all these posters um and now it is time for me to take down the old ones I'm watching rhythmic gymnastics but Yes, it's time for me to take down all the old posters, so let me just do that. It's so weird to see my wall completely blank and empty, but um, basically I kept like these old ones because I'm not really sure whether um, these are going to fill up the whole wall. I strongly doubt it, so I just wanted some like to fill up the spaces and like um i threw away the spotify ones because i know for sure that i don't want to keep them but like the other ones they're still kind of okay like i don't mind having them there so now it's time for me to try and figure out what layout i want brb
Okay, just pausing the time lapse for a second. This is kind of roughly what I've come up with. As you guys can see, I'm mixing like my old posters with my new ones because um, like they kind of fill in some spaces. And I like um, that I spread out my movies this time instead of having them all in one line. Um, these ones I've kind of just pasted like half-heartedly because I'm not really sure whether I want them there. Um, but yeah, I'm gonna finish using up the rest of the newer posters and use the old ones to fill in the spaces and then I'm almost done and then I'll show you guys the finished product. Okay, after much deliberation, here is my final wall. Um, to be honest, they were a little bit um, wonky and I did have to rearrange every single one to make them like straight. I know they don't look straight, like, I mean I'm holding the camera so that they're straight, but like in person they kind of still don't look straight. But I've, I've checked with my ruler lots of times that like, you know, it's parallel and everything and it is. So like, I don't know what it is, but anyways, they are straight, okay? Um, I will now be giving you a small tour about each poster and telling you why I chose it. Um, as if to hear. Trust me, when I'm on TikTok live, like people always ask me about my wall and this is just so that I can just be like, watch my YouTube video instead of me having to like explain it every time, okay? So the first poster closest to the right, you know, when I wake up straight away, boom, this is when I see, hi, welcome to another day. The reason I chose this is because I really like the little aura circle thingies and like, I just think these are like nice little reminders for yourself when you wake up. Yeah. Anyways, moving on, we have my Scotland poster, which I already had previously. Um, and my Mamma poster as well. These were from the previous design and I just put them in because they like fit in. Then we have this quirky looking art piece. I just think they look kind of cute and I like the modern minimal style of it. Coraline, we have a New York City poster because who doesn't love New York City and also I just like the art style again. Um, and then we have this beautiful poster, Why Was I Born a Train? You know, Thomas the Tank Engine vibes, I love it. Next one, Ratatouille, already been there. Next we have this like temperature, what do you call this thing? Like a heat scanning kind of thing that shows like two people that bought a kiss or something, I don't know. Uh, kind of cute, I liked it. Moving on, we have a Positions poster, Ariana Grande. Um, I'm pretty sure this is some kind of fan edit, but I think it looked really cool. Looked, I think it looks very cool. Um, and yeah, it's just you know about her album, all the songs around here. Love it. Next, we have Singapore and up, which we already had. We have look for something positive each day, even if some days it's a little harder. And I cut this like not very straight, but we're just gonna pretend that did not happen, okay? Um, we're gonna focus on the quotes, um, positive vibes only. Next one is Mickey Mouse. We already had this one last time. Moving on, waves of life. Happy sad, happy sad, happy sad. I think it's self explanatory. Next, we have Gemini, um, the agate. I don't know, just a, a pretty poster that I found. Um, and I'm a Gemini. So next, one, people ask what is it? I'll just click this. Um, and at the bottom, it says. Keywords, tough, receptive, unique, multi-layered, and what can I say? I am pretty unique and multi-layered. Anyways, <laughs> then we have the Olivia Rodrigo Sour, like, wristy, um, because obviously I love sour, um, and yeah, I just need to have that on my wall. Then we have my old Nike poster, and this one is a heart that says, you deserve the love that you keep trying to get everyone else. You know, just more inspirational quotes for myself when I'm, like, emailing in the middle of the night in bed. And then we have self-love, self-care, because self-love is so important, and then we have my old Apple poster. Um, not gonna lie, I do feel like that side of the wall still feels a little bit empty, so, like, I'll probably over time fill that up, but I am pretty happy with how this came out. I definitely prefer it to my old one. I feel like the Spotify thing is getting old and annoying. Anyways, um, not Evie is inspired by me, and she too is searching for things to put on her wall because I'm a trendsetter. But, yeah, so that's kind of it. I will stand up and show you, like, a better view of this. Hold on. So here is what it looks like, um, as a whole. It is kind of like a lot to take in, but I feel like I like each individual little thing. Mickey Mouse looks a little bit not straight and it's kind of annoying me, but I can't be bothered to straighten it again. Anyways, um, yeah, so the edge of it there, you see, it looks kind of empty and that's kind of what I want to fill up. But for now, I'm pretty happy with this and yeah, that's kind of it for this video. Um, if you liked it, don't forget to hit the thumbs up and subscribe. <laughs> um, and also I hope that this kind of acted as a tutorial on like how I designed my wall because like people were always asking me like how I did it because like I just printed it from paper, you know. And yeah, I'm pretty happy with it. Um, Alright, let me know what you think in the comments and I will see you guys whenever I post my next video. Goodbye. Yeah.